The evening is scared as Southwest Valley High School has students and parents on edge. Thanks for joining us at 5. I'm Denise Valdez. And I'm Brian Loftus. A 15-year-old boy in police custody after officers say he made threats to bring a gun to school and shoot up an assembly. 8 News Now reporter Sasha Loftus live near Desert Oasis High with how that threat was discovered. Sasha? Well, Denise and Brian, we spoke with quite a few parents and students outside of Desert Oasis High School today, and that a lot of them told me they really didn't have any idea that this happened. They do say, though, they're glad the school stepped in before anything happened and anyone got hurt. Now, CCSD police tell 8 News Now school staff contacted officers after students reported a teenager's plan to bring a gun to school Friday and shoot up a planned assembly. Reports led officers to a 15-year-old boy who reportedly made those threats. Law enforcement took him into custody, then went to the student's home and confiscated several firearms. No word on whether the teenager had access to these weapons. One other Desert Oasis student we spoke with today says it's unusual to hear about something like this happening here, but she's grateful school officials stepped in at the right time. It's scary that we could get hurt in school, you yeah. know, when we're supposed to be safe here. It's really good that we don't have to hear about it until he's caught, you know, not that no, we don't have to hear about it after it already happens. Now, CCSD police say the 15-year-old was taken to the juvenile detention center and is facing charges for making terrorist threats toward a school. Now, we do have a copy of the message that the school's principal sent out to parents. A few of them say they received that and they received a robocall as well, but some say they didn't have any information on this. They were not contacted. They didn't even know about it until their students told them, so no word on how these messages were distributed. Now, this, of course, is a developing situation, so stay with 8 News Now for the latest on this tonight. Reporting live at Desert Oasis High School, Sasha Loftus, 8 News Now. Sasha.